Well, the birds are waking up. The actual temperature is 9 below, and the wind chill is 32 below. And they're going, oh, no, we got to go back inside. It's cold. Every once in a while, they get brave, and they come out. I threw some food on the snow because some of the bigger birds don't let the littler birds get down there to, to eat. But they seem to be finding it just fine. And there are some birds in the feeder. But they keep flying back into their little house. At least they got some place to stay warm. I don't know how warm they really are. But if, wouldn't it be sad that you're that hungry? You have to go out and forage in the cold. <laughs> See, we complain about being in the house and saying that we kind of graze, but we're in warmth. They're out in the freezing cold. Something to think about. Well, good morning. Today is third, no, it's Wednesday. I had to think for a minute. Today's Wednesday. Wednesday, January 30th. Tomorrow's the last day of the month. It's my sister-in-law's birthday tomorrow, but she doesn't watch my channel, so guess what? She's not getting a song. Um, and there's nobody's birthday today. Sorry. But I wanted to um, get on here and tell Lily B, L-I-L-L-I-B-B, -L -L -I -B -B, that she stumped me. <laughs> she said to have, to have her heard the commercial Frosty Morn. I kept thinking, frosty morn, frosty morn. You you stumped me. What's a frosty morn? I, I don't know if that's a cereal or a weather thing. You've, you've stumped me. Congratulations. But Joan Johnson thought she'd stump me with Pepsodent. You wonder where the yellow went when you brushed your teeth with Pepsodent. <laughs> and then it got rattling all these stupid commercials in my mind. Soup and sandwich soup. Soup and sandwich, everything. Wait a minute. Soup and sandwich, soup and sandwich. Have your favorite Campbell soup and sandwich. Any time or weather. Soup and sandwich go together. In the valley of the jolly ho, ho, ho. Green giant. Too many. Hey, Mabel, black label. I don't know how to whistle. I always go, <laughs> that's my whistle. You're supposed to whistle for it. I'm trying to think of another one. Brill cream, a little dab will do ya. They'll wanna run your fingers through your hair. Oh, they'll wanna run their fingers through your hair. And I, how do I know all these hot dog commercials when I absolutely positively hate hot dogs? Hot dogs, armor hot dogs. What kind of kids eat armor hot dogs? Short kids, fat kids, skinny kids. No, and short kids, fat kids. Kids that like climb on rocks. Short, no, and hot dogs, armor hot dogs. What kind of kids eat armor hot dogs? Short kids, skinny kids. Kids that climb on rocks. Fat kids, skinny kids. Even kids with chicken pox love hot dogs. <laughs> I don't know the whole commercial, but you'll have to help me with that one. Hot dogs. Hot dogs. What kind of kids that climb on hot dogs? Short kids. Fat kids. Kids that climb on rocks. Old kids. Young kids. Even ones with chicken pox. That's not even right either. But, anyhow. Things that come into my head. I'm telling you. Useless. Useless information. So, um... Staying in today, you might hear Jim, he's downstairs sanding, but I thought I'd come in here real quick before he starts sanding again. Uh, we went and got this stain for the deck yesterday. Last night, we should have stayed home, but you know, we, we went out because we knew it was going to be cold today. Because right now, it's 7 below with the wind chill at 29 below. It's cold. It's really, really cold. His dentist called and canceled his appointment even. Christy had off of work. I'm said on my videos yesterday I hope the mail doesn't deliver but I'm sure they probably will we could have put in for no delivery but you know they still gonna be out there I just think that the whole mail department the whole mail service should just say we're done not today it's too cold and uh, now that I'm looking the plows came down the street I didn't even notice that I didn't even hear them they came and plowed the street so Jim's got to go out there and 
dig us out of the driveway because you know how you get that little pile of snow at the bottom. But um, anyhow, um, I wanted to tell you that I have in the links below, and hopefully I remember by the end of the video, but I think I will. Uh, Mima, or Mima M7 has just started her channel, and I told her I'd check it out, and it's, oh my gosh, I don't know what, wait, why she waited so long, because it's like so professional looking, and it's a really, it's a quick little one and a half minute video, uh, her introduction video, and um, I subscribed, so um, go, I'm going to leave the link down below. I know she's trying to change it, I think, to Mima McLiving Healthy Beginnings. But right now, if you go to M-E-E-M-A-M-7, -E -E that's her channel. But I have the link down below. And um, she's just starting out, so um, go check her out for me. She's a Weight Watcher. She's uh, strong in her faith, like me. Makes no apologies for it. If I offend anybody by that, I don't really need you on my channel anyhow. I'm going to get a dislike for that. I don't really care. Um, you know, there's a plan for me. I don't know what it is yet, but I'm sure there's a plan for me. <laughs> So I'm um, going to go eat breakfast and um, just stay on track for the day because I think I'm doing pretty good. Stay warm. That's my plan. Stay warm. Stay in. So, okay, I'll talk to you guys at breakfast. Well, I'll talk to you again later on. You know me. You can't stop me. Well, I measured my fruit because I'm missing my berries. And I know it's a little bit heaping over the top, but it's kind of hard to have a leveled off strawberries. So I uh, started my day with a prayer. I drank 50 ounces of water. My quote is, instead of giving myself reasons why I can't, I give myself reasons why I can. 23 smart points, zero for my chicken, egg, berries, banana, tea, and water. Three points for my half of a lender's bagel and one for my laughing cow cheese. Four points, I have 19 points left for the rest of my day. Okay, I'm gonna have a taco bowl without the uh, taco. <laughs> uh, it's 13 points though. It's zero for my one cup of fat-free refried beans. Four point, oh, it's zero for one cup. Four points for three ounces of the 80-20 ground sirloin. Zero points for the tomatoes, my tea, my water's in the other room. Five points for a third of a cup. I grabbed the wrong measuring cup. Uh, three points for two tablespoons of sour cream and one point for two tablespoons of black olives. So it comes to 13 points. I still have six points left. Right now. Wind chills of 66 below in Minnesota, negative 40s in Chicago. And take a look, it's not much better in our own backyard. As the Arctic blast moves down from the North Pole, 32 states are on alert. Yeah, Dave, is the worst behind us yet, or what can we expect moving forward? Not really. It's going to be about the same kind of feel this evening, tonight, into and through tomorrow morning. Now, the morning stops at 11 a.m., but things don't automatically get better. It's still going to be a major problem with dangerous life-threatening wind chills through all day tomorrow and through a good chunk of Friday as well. The fog doesn't really begin until Saturday. That's important for you to know. And the longer this lasts, the effects just kind of compound themselves. So it becomes a bigger and bigger issue for uh, people in life and for property as well. Seven below outside right now, but here's the issue. A southwest wind at 15 miles an hour. That's as light as it has been all day, though. The gust in Detroit is almost double that to 29 miles an hour. So gusting around 30. Of course, now so much colder. So the temperatures right now, again, seven below in Detroit. That's been the record low so far today. We'll get colder as the evening goes along. And only two below in Port Huron, 11 below in Adrian. That's the spread. But the wind, of course, again, around 30 miles an hour. Some of those gusts, it feels 30 below in Gross Eel, 32 below in Ipsy, 34 below for Ann Arbor and Monroe and a little bit better again in Port Huron at 19 below. That one little area has been kind of helped with the wind and the temperature being up quite a bit higher. So we're below zero now. Overnight tonight, we'll go to 15 below. That will just annihilate the all-time record low for tomorrow. It'll probably still feel like that 25 to 30 below to start. Well, as you can see, it's very cold here. Right now it is uh, nine below. And uh, the wind chill, I think, is 34. I'm in the house, all nice and warm. I don't have to worry. Jim went to his, um, I think it's his archery league tonight. But they're in, inside a heated barn, so he'll be fine. I thought they'd kill it off because of the weather, but no, no such luck. And I'm happy to report that in Michigan, I think in Wisconsin too, no mail delivery today or tomorrow, thankfully. I mean, the office is open if you need to go mail something in the office, but then they're warm inside, so... 
I'm sure they'll have other work for the other people to do. I'm sure they didn't have it off completely, but maybe they did. I don't know. So, um, any hooser. Tomorrow we're going to have the big turkey dinner. And I have to go to the doctor's in the morning. And that's about it. That's all I got. That's all I got for now. That's all. That, that, that's all, folks. So, um, give the video a like. Leave a comment subscribe and share and I will see you guys in the morning and then don't forget to check out Meemaw M7's video it's just a short like minute and a half and see if you like her channel I'm sure you will okay I'll talk to you guys tomorrow